Hi, this is Freya, helping you become the master of your voice. Today I want to talk about talent versus hard work. Do you need talent to sing good or do you need to put in more hard work? What's more important or without talent, can you even sing? Or if you put in hard work, can you get better? Oh, well, let's talk about it. Stay tuned. I get asked this question so many times. Raya, you seem to have just a beautiful voice. Is it God-given or was it hard work? And well, in my case, I can say probably a lot of it is talent because I could always sing and I didn't really have to think about it. And But a lot of it is also hard work. Everything that I have now as far as technique goes came from hard work and that I can still sing and that I can sing for hours and hours and do all these different genres that came from hard work and from really learning and being a student and really acquiring technique things that help me. Now I always put it like this is the 100%. The 100% is the whole thing that makes you a good singer and for some people it will be divided up differently. So for someone like me for example maybe I have 70% talent. But if you have 70% talent and only rely on your talent, you will only get ever to 70%. You will never get to be like the 100% you could be. It's only going to stay at 70%. Just because with talent alone, it's great and good. But when it comes to really hard stuff, you do, you really, there's like a limit to how far you can go. And especially when it comes to technique and singing a lot and singing professionally and singing long periods of time, doing very difficult things, it takes a toll on your voice when you don't really have that training and that foundation of a good technique of how you can sing for the rest of your life. Now, on the other hand, if you have maybe 30% talent and you think, I just can't even sing, I can't carry a tune, it's bad. That 70% of hard work you're going to have to make up to reach that 100%, it is going to be a long way. It's going gonna, it's gonna to take a lot longer to come to those 100% than someone who just has natural talent. But at the same time, you could be at that 70%, the same place where that person with that 70% talent is, and be there if that person with a lot of talent doesn't put in any work. And vice versa, if you just put in a lot of work and you don't have a lot of talent, you're just going to have to put in a lot more work. See, it just kind of adds, it adds, both elements add. And I think in order to become really truly awesome, you do need both elements. But which doesn't mean that if you start out with a voice that you can't control at all, that you can't find the beauty in your voice. And sometimes Maybe you're struggling for years, but maybe it's just because you haven't found your voice yet. And sometimes it really can happen rather quickly that you just realize, I felt something. This is where my voice is. I'm, I have been trying to push it into a direction that it never wanted to go just because it's not natural. So it has a lot to do with also really trying to find your natural voice and to relax into it and not to push yourself into something that you will never ever be. So if you adore belting and that's your whole world and all you ever work on is belting, 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 singing high, singing high, but your natural voice doesn't really have a tendency to want to go there because maybe you have this softer voice, but you're never exploring that part because you always just want to push it to the belting and high singing part. You're going to be frustrated and you're actually going to hurt yourself doing it. And you're never going to reach that 100% by just always pushing yourself into a direction that is just not good for you. So that's that for today. And I hope this encourages you because how you get to this 100%, this is all up to you. Just add it up and either you have to work a lot or you just have to really, you know, put in skin in the game. This is really important. Thanks for watching today. I hope you're going to be back next week. If you liked the video, I would appreciate it if you gave it a thumbs up to let me know you appreciate it. And if you have not subscribed, hit that button and make sure you don't miss any future videos. And if you have not joined my Facebook community, 
master your voice. I would love to see you there and carry on the conversation and talk and get to know your voice. Have a wonderful day. Until next time, don't forget, always keep a song in your heart and always keep on singing. Bye.